so now let's open this phone if you are uncoupling an Android phone the first thing you need to do you need to check the bottom side if there is any screw holding it if there is not you look observe the body very well if there is nothing like any screw holding it then this is what you are going to do train your finger this finger should be trained this this one should be trained so that to enable you to unlock the phone you observe this side this part of the phone to put your finger in there you can try that with your android device on your hand put your finger in there try moving it like round round like as in put it very well round and then is 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 open like this now but be careful this is your fingerprint when opening like is almost open but don't force it out this is your finger sensor fingerprint sensor hold it firmly down before bringing popping up this back this thing if not it might spoil it so so this is it now this is the fingerprint so now let's uncouple it this is your battery this is how inbuilt battery look like so like let me lose the mobile phone my mobile phone is loose. It's dismantled. You see? So everything I've been showing you, I'm going to show you the practical, as in how is it is on the mobile phone. So now this is your thing. This is your power flex. This is your power flex. Yeah. That is what enables it. See? This this. Case, this thing is just casing that enables you to press this stuff. This is your power flex. This is the power. You understand? This is the power. This is the volume down and this is the volume up. And this is where it's connected to the main board. So if you, are, if you want to uncouple it, you, you need to unclip it like this. It's out. You understand? This is your network antenna. The same thing, if you want to open it, you need to bring it out. But using, you need a pin. I'm at home doing this, so most of my instrument, my tools, are in my mobile shop. So, but I'm going to be using what I have here. You need a pin, but the normal thing you need to use is your picker. I've shown you people what picker is on the previous video. So now let's bring it out. Bring it out like this. So the, the, this is the network antenna. Is out. So this network antenna run down to the down board. You understand? It's it's run down from the main board to the down board. This is where the provision of the down board is. So let me uncouple it. Let me use the down board to show you how the down board looks like. The down board comprises of the mouthpiece, the charging port, um, the vibrator, and also a provision where your network antenna is connected to. So a mobile phone that is not having network, you try checking this network antenna if it's working perfectly. So with time, you are going to know on how to test your network antenna, everything about that. So, so after losing them, let's bring it out this is it so this is the speaker i'm telling you about these are the legs this leg now will contact to this place this is the network antenna if you notice very well you'll see that it is being connected to the down board let me zoom it a little bit you see so this is where it's connected to to the down board so we have removed it now this is the network antenna and this is let me zoom it a little bit for you let me zoom it zoom it a little bit yeah and this this here now is your battery this is your battery so now let's unclip this battery from this main board so this is how it's been done you unclip it like this using your fingernails to unclip it is unclip so now let's bring out the battery let's bring out the battery so this is the inbuilt battery this is the inbuilt battery so now you see the connection now you see the connection so now from that picture i sent to you guys there's a connection there's a flex i called the flex that connects your down board to your main board this is how the, this is the flex you see this is the flex it's connecting the down board to the main pcb board this is the flex so without this thing being clipped here if this stuff is not clipped here now it's not going to work you understand so this is connecting the main board to this down board and now this down board what are the as in what does it consist of it consists of the mouthpiece this here now is your digital mouthpiece 
This is your digital mouthpiece. We have universal mouthpiece and we have digital mouthpiece. This here is your digital mouthpiece. This is the, the connector of the um, network, the network connector. You understand? And this this here now is your diode. And here, this stuff covering with red stuff, let me bring it out, is your vibrator. So, and here, here is your charging port. You see? You see? This is the charging port. You understand? This is the charging port. That is the charging system. And we are going to clip this down one now. So the sub board is out. So most time when a fault, like a fault comes to you now that they say, my mouthpiece is not working. I know very well that it's a digital mouthpiece. This is an Android device. Some Android device do come with universal mouthpiece. Some do come with digital mouthpiece. So for now, you have not learned very well on how to change the digital mouthpiece. But with time, I will show you guys on how to change this. But this will be the next month's training that you'll be learning this. And how you can learn it now is very to be compacted in your memory. So the thing you have to do, if your thoughts like this come to you, uh, the, the customer say, my, I'm speaking, they are not hearing me, but me, I'm hearing them. What you do, you change this. The main thing you need to do is to change this mouthpiece. But for now, you don't know how to change it. The best thing to do, you tell the customer that he or she should change this damn board completely. So in the market, they do sell this damn board 500 Naira. You understand? It's five, it's sold 500 Naira. But um, that is in Nigeria currency. You can convert it to your own currency. It depends. You understand? So once you get this down board and replace it, the mouthpiece start working. Or if you are asked to change charging port, I don't know how to change charging port yet. You change the down board completely. You understand? That is it. So this is the vibrator. This is where the, the connection is, and it's being is contact. I mean, it do contact to these two places. That is contacting this guy now. It's contacting here. You understand? Now, coupling it back, you need to just assemble it. Get this guy. Get this guy. Now, fix it very well. You see? Now, get this guy. Make sure you assemble everything. That makes you a good engineer. So that none of them will miss. So this stuff now is the protector of the mouthpiece. It's covering the mouthpiece. That is what you see. So now, let's put it back. It's been done now. Now clip back this flex. <coughs> you understand? Now the, the flex is clipped. So now you see this observe this second flex that is here. This second flex. This second flex is the main flex. That is the main screen flex. This is the LCD. That is the light. Um that is the is, a, is an abbreviation for screen. You understand? This is the LCD. This is the that is the flex for this screen. The flex for the inner screen. That is the flex. This is the LCD. This is the that is, so now it's being connected to the main board. Let me zoom in to show you. See, look at where it's connected to. So now, if your screen is having issue, the first thing you need to do, you unclip this, unclip it. This is it. This is it. Let me show you very well. Camera. See, this is the flex. Every phone has its own. So now this is where it's connected to. You can clip it back if you wish. I can unclip it using your nails. You understand? So now it's out. Same likewise to this side. So if a screen is having issue, once you service this clip, this clip here, this mount, and you also service here, it doesn't work. You need to change the flex, the screen. Now, how you bring your screen out, you, you'll be seeing the video. Maybe in next previous, the next class we are going to be doing. You understand? So this is the screen and this is the screen flex so now let me go forward to show you different the other parts now let's bring out this panel this pcb board out let's bring out the pcb board out you observe that there's a screw here holding the pcb board so unscrew it you need to be observer if you are an engineer in everything you do so let's bring it out i'll bring it out and again let's bring out the board use your needle but the appropriate one is to use your picker but my picker is not here so let's bring it out so this is it now this is the board this is the speaker i sent to you you know we have two type of speaker in a mobile phone we have the earpiece this is a mini speaker the earpiece enable you to hear listen to what the other user is saying when making call and we also have the main speaker this is the main speaker it brings out sound when playing music and it's at the down board so let's close this side now because you have learned everything about here. So now, this year, this year now, 
is your main this is the speaker you use in listening to conversation when making call and this is the opening you understand so this is the speaker and yeah let's let me show you this our big board our panel for you to understand it very well so now we have something covering this earpiece let's bring it out so now this is your earpiece connector now this is that proximity sensor i'm telling you about this proximity sensor is what enables the user when making call or listening to audio record through whatsapp when once you close it it goes dim it makes your screen to go dim the essence of that is because because if it didn't go dim when you bring your phone close to your skin your so as we were saying let's this is let's this we have brought out the panel like this now and i've removed the camera this is what this was where the camera were this is the front camera and this is the back camera you understand so now let me unclip them so if you want to remove it with your finger too you push it put it last it and you bring it pop it up like this same thing goes to this side pop it up and the camera is out you understand so now remember when i was telling about proximity sensor this is the proximity sensor this is the proximity sensor and this is the front flashlight so this proximity sensor is close to this front flashlight so from this phone now this is the place that the proximity sensor is so let's put the panel back so that you see what i'm trying to explain so this is where the proximity sensor is once you close this now the screen will go dim when you are making call or anything you understand so this is it and next we are going to be talking about those things that i found in this panel those resistors the all those eyes have been sending and posting on the group this platform so you are going to be seeing them so for instance this one now is your sim port and this is your memory card port and this here is your back camera port see how it looks like that is your back camera port and also this is your front camera port and from explanation i told you this is the proximity sensor and this is your earpiece that is the, that is the earpiece when you want to use earphone to listen and this is the sub board clip this is the screen clip this is um the battery terminal that is where you clip your battery terminal for instance this is the battery and this is the battery mount so this mount now is going inside here so let me show you something so you just clip what you just do you just get it and you clip it you understand you clip it so now it's done it's been connected so if you want to remove it still the same process use your fingernails you pop it out like this so now it's out you understand so that is it so now let's go forward let me be showing you some other things so let me bring it up a little so i can view it very well so now this year now they are called IC. This thing now is an IC. You understand? This is an IC. This thing here now, this component here, this is a capacitor. This stuff here is a capacitor. This is a capacitor. This is a capacitor. This black stuff is an IC. This is a capacitor. This is a capacitor. This is a capacitor. Here now, this one is coil. You understand? Once you watch it very well, that is a coil. Here now, this is a diode. You understand this one now is a diode that is a diode you understand so those are called diode and this is the back flashlight and this here this tiny black thing is a resistor it's called resistor same goes to this place yeah these are resistors you understand these are resistors and um next we're going to be talking about the other component on mobile phone so just stay tuned so let me show you how to couple them back once you couple them back this is the camera the back camera so let's clip it boom we have clipped it this is the front camera let's clip it back it's been clipped so moving forward this you put this back Here and it's covering the size, so this is it. So now 
let's couple this back this is the mobile phone hmm? so this is the board now assemble this you see what i'm doing you clip this clip this that is the screen clip it and this is the sub board flex clip it too once you have done that get your network antenna this is the network antenna that will unclip so the network antenna is being is clipped here so let's clip it very careful this is your nails you need to grow nails if you want to be an engineer you need to grow nails or if you don't you need to grow nails you need appropriate tools for all this so now let's go this is the downboard remember the clip the network clip is connected to the downboard and the main board so this is where it's going to be clipped so let's clip it there make sure you clip it there if you do not clip it very well the network won't come the phone won't have network so make sure you clip that very well it's not yet clipped yet uh, yeah it's clipped now so now back remember i told you guys that here is the power flex this is the power flex this is the power button the volume down and the volume up so now let me clip this back clip it uh, it's connected to the panel so this is your battery let's get your battery and let's clip it to this place remember remember what i told you the battery have different mount but this this is how the mount looks like you understand this is how the mount looks like so and this is where it's being clipped that is the housing so let's clip it now it's done now so now moving forward this is the back cover and this is your fingerprint clip this is where it's connected let me zoom it a little bit so you see this is where the fingerprint is flex connected this is fingerprint so now let's clip it clip it this is it so let's clip it here but well, you can still cover it to clip by itself for in most phones you need to clip it first but this one there is no need to just you see it's clipped now as you can see it's clipped you understand so now let's screw them let's screw them let's screw them boom uh huh so this is the down but make sure you screw all the screws i'll be fast to that it take much of our time and this is the down board now i'll screen it uh -huh. you screw everything so i don't have time to go so, uh, now this is the back cover this is the back cover you put it back and you press it you press it very well be careful don't press it much just at this edge side edge is clipping them all that is done your phone is being 